Hi there, YouTube friends. This is Lester Verano here, and thank you for joining me once again for a product review. Uh, today, we're reviewing the Douglas Field L Lighter, and I want to talk about uh, how I arrived at the decision to purchase a lighter and uh, why I have this particular one here in my hand and why I think this belongs on my channel. So... I often think about the kind of gear that I would like to carry with me uh, if I were to go on a short or even extended day backpacking trip. And um, one of the first things that comes to my mind is, how am I going to be starting fires uh, while I'm camping? And of course, the first thing that comes next to my mind is, well, a Firo rod. A Firo rod is... Uh, Firo cerium rod is actually Firo cerium is actually a mineral, uh, an earth metal uh, that is mined from different areas of the world, and it uh, is a metal that can be honed down into the shape of a rod, and that rod can be uh, struck off the back of a pocket knife blade to create a spark. So therefore, it is a reliable way to start a campfire. But why not just carry a lighter? And I think you should, and I think you should carry both. Um, so the next thought uh, that occurs is to me is, well, what is the best lighter? Uh, as I've said in like a lot of my other videos, uh, whenever I try to, whenever I go out and make a purchase, uh, one of the first things I try to do is see what is the best that's out there of what I'm trying to buy. And sometimes I'll just buy the best if I can afford it. And if not, I'll see what the best is and then just kind of work my way down. And so in this case, um, I, you know, my thought, uh, we went to uh, lighters and I wanted to know what was the best. So I did my research and uh, everything uh, I did uh, to try to narrow down what is the best lighter has led me to the Douglas Field L lighter. This lighter comes from the Tokyo Pipe Company in Japan. Uh, I've only known about this for the last couple of years, and I've learned about it through some YouTube uh, reviews. And so let's just get it out of the box and see what it is all about. Let's see what separates it from the rest. Let's see why in March of 2021, when I Google this thing, all the websites that I find that sell it are sold out. That must be for a reason, right? So I actually ended up getting this off of eBay. Uh, I had it FedExed from Japan, and let's get into it. So, first impressions, actually not my first impressions, I've already had it out, um, but my first impressions were, uh, the build call quality is supreme. Uh, this thing has a nice, really nice weight to it, and nothing about this lighter feels chintzy or cheap. And I'm excited to say I think I am the only YouTube uh, person who has actually given an up-close look at the brass and stainless uh, color uh, for this lighter. So whoop de doo for me. I like to hope that at the very least uh, you get a really great visual of this lighter. So, let's light it. Now that feels good. It's a really good, uh, hearty flame. I really like that. The cap seals up that wick on the top. And the action is superb. No back and forth play here. Really solid lockup. Feels like quality. Look at the precision machining we have here. So let's talk about the design a little bit. So it comes like this right out of the box. It's ready to go. You have two tubes here. Uh, let's unscrew the cap here in the bottom and show you what this is all about. Really nice. So we have an O-ring right there. And as soon as you get this out of the box, you can just um, unscrew this. You squirt your lighter fluid down in here. I wouldn't use anything else, just lighter fluid. And you're good to go. She lights right up. 
Now, what's really special about this, another thing that uh, separates it from a lot of other lighters is, so you have this O-ring down here, and then you have the cap sealing this up here, up at, up at the top. And so you preserve your lighter fluid. Now, I've heard anywhere from three to five weeks and beyond um, that this thing will still light up. So it doesn't take nearly as much lighter fluid to fill this thing up as a Zippo does. And, um, well, that's what it's all about, right? You want to have something that's going to uh, preserve your, your fuel, and this will do that. So I believe it is in that way, it is uh, superior to, you know, your Zippos and stuff out there. And I'm not beating up Zippo. I like Zippos. I collect them. I still collect them. I'll still buy them. Um, but they just, they're just, they dry up, um, you know, three or four or five days tops and you're refilling a Zippo. Uh, something like this, you know, you have a lot longer uh, period of time before you're going to have to refill it. So that's that. So you got your wick in there. Then you have this tube right here. This tube has your flint and your flint spring. And I'm not going to undo this little screw because then I'm going to struggle with it. And uh, I don't really feel like doing that right now. But yeah, there's a screw right there. You have your flint and your flint spring in there. And I just really like this lighter. Uh, for me, it crosses into a couple different areas. Uh, well, first of all, you know, like I said, it, it, I believe it to be an outlasting product. This, you know, with, with the right kind of care, it's absolutely a lifelong product. So I like buying uh, stuff that, you know, it's a one-time buy. And uh, it's collectible. I mean, this is absolutely a beautiful little lighter. I mean, look at this thing. It's gorgeous. Um, I, I'm a collector, and so it, it's got a, you know, it's got some, it's a collectability um, factor here. And then there's just a, a, a usability factor. I mean, what a great lighter for camping. I mean, I think this paired with a good uh, ferro rod, it would be great, uh, would be great gear to have in your backpack. So I wanted to share this with you. I think it belongs here on the channel and I'm really happy to, to share it with you. If this is the first time you're hearing about it, I'm really uh, proud to say I'm the person that, that, uh, that showed it to you. And this is the Douglas Field L lighter it comes from the Tokyo Pipe Company in Japan, and I just hope, uh, at the very least, you can take a great visual of this lighter from this video if it's something you're thinking about buying. And I hope you liked it. So there it is. Not much more to say about it. Thank you all so much for being here. I appreciate you. I love when you subscribe to the channel. That really lights my flame. So. Please subscribe and please join me for the next video. Be safe out there. Peace and goodbye.